the free motion quilting tutorial for fossil snail. Um, what you do with this fill is you create kind of an initial, I guess you say outline of the snail, and then you're going to come inside with a spiral shape. And the tip of that spiral shape is important. What you're going to do is you're going to pivot off of that to the edge of kind of your snail outline, and then you'll travel just a little bit and then go back to the center of that spiral. You'll continue to pivot, hit that edge, travel, and then come back and pivot all the way back out of the snail shape. And this gives you a really neat texture, especially when it's repeated over a fairly big surface. It is time consuming and it is fairly advanced because of the amount of traveling and the precision that you need to have in order to kind of hit those areas pretty precisely. But um, I'm sure if you try it and really practice it, it'll be perfectly fine. Um, this was inspired by a picture of a fossilized snail. I go to the library oftentimes and just check out books on photography, uh, especially pictures of the earth, and I love aerial photos. They really give you an idea, a really pretty idea of what the texture, many different textures that we can then try and duplicate in free motion quilting. This fill is not going to fill your space perfectly, like you're not going to just fill it with circles. And, and so really try and make it organic with nice uh, spirals and swirls. And here's what it looks like. Here's what my example looks like when it was finished. And for more free motion quilting videos, check out my website, daystyledesigns.com.